Hey, baby. Um, I'm about to leave, so if you need anything, just let me know, alright? Well, yeah, I'm about to go to the party I told you about earlier, remember? Or were you too busy with your work to understand what I was talking about? <laughs> I mean, when I told you about the party, you said, yeah, yeah, okay, sure. And then you kind of just pushed me out of the room, so. On one hand, I took it as a, you got it. And on the other hand, I took it as a, you weren't really paying attention. So I kind of just took my chances. It's for one of my coworkers. She's celebrating her being promoted, and she invited all past and current workers, employees, whatever you want to call them, to join. And since you used to work at the company, you also got an invitation, but you were too busy to see it, so... Yeah. No, it's okay, it's fine. I'll just go, unless you want to get ready really quickly and we can go together. Of course I want you there with me, baby. I love you, and I want to go everywhere with you. I'll be waiting on the couch, okay? Take your time, there's no rush. It's better to show up late than to not show up at all, right? <laughs> Oh my god. When I said get ready quickly, I didn't mean that fast, and you look absolutely beautiful. I'm blushing. Now I'm kind of worried. If I bring you to this party, what's stopping guys from hitting on you and flirting with you? I'm going to get protective, and I might do something I'm going to regret. I'm just letting you know. You're mine. All mine. Nobody else can have you. You understand me? Good girl. You ready to go? Alright, off we go. Okay, we're here. Now, as I said before, you did used to work at the company, so... You're going to know a plethora of people in this party, so you're not going to be lonely. Yeah, because I have friends that I wanted to meet up with that I haven't talked to in a while since our work schedules are kind of different. We clock in and clock out at different times, so this is kind of my one and only chance to, I guess, talk and hang out with them. So I trust that you'll be on your best behavior. And you won't do anything stupid, okay? And one last thing before we go inside. Can you please try your best to push away any flirters or people that are approaching you? Or if they are approaching you, get them away from you before I see it. Because I will blow a fuse. And I, I don't want to, okay? Does that make sense? Is that a good enough reason? Good. Enjoy yourself. I love you. And I'll talk to you soon, okay? Amazing. Hey, boys. What's up? Long time no see. Even though we work in the same company, we never get to see each other. How's your wife? I heard that you guys just had a kid, and I, I don't know, you guys are absolutely amazing. Oh, me? Yeah, me and my girlfriend, we're, we're doing pretty good. We're at a stable level. Before, it, it was kind of bad, I guess, but we've been rebuilding, and it's going amazing. I even brought her with me today. She's over there. Hold on, guys. I'll... I'll be back. You've gotta be kidding me. Who was that guy just now? Look at me. 
I said, look at me. Don't make me repeat myself. It was a guy that came up to you and tried to flirt with you. And you didn't try to push him away? You did, but he wasn't listening. Hey, you. Yes, you, the guy that just walked away. Come here. What were you doing with my girlfriend? You were flirting with her, and you didn't know that she was in a relationship. See, I would have let that off the hook if I wasn't crazy. And did you not see the obvious promise ring on her finger? Meaning that she's with somebody, jerk? Wait, you aren't a plus one. You work at the company. I've seen you around. Meaning, you should have some manners, and you should have some class, and know what's right and what's wrong. I guess I was wrong. Thinking that people in here would actually behave themselves. Are you okay, baby? Are you uncomfortable? Yo, back off. I'm trying to make sure my girlfriend is okay. My girlfriend, not yours. So if you would kindly leave us alone before I black out, that would be very much appreciated. Got me? Good. Go enjoy your party. You idiot. Anyways. Are you sure you're okay? He didn't hit you, he didn't touch you, he didn't bother you. Look at me. You don't have to lie to me, baby. I won't cause a scene if you don't want me to. He touched your shoulder. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, I'm fine. I'm fine, I promise. I promise. <sighs> you still want to stay here, or do you want to go? I don't care about those boys. I care about you. Are you comfortable staying or do you want to leave? You want to leave? Okay, give me one second to tell those boys goodbye. Hi right, boys, so I ran into a little mishap. I heard you guys are throwing another party next week for I think it was Jeff's promotion, which of course is absolutely Amazing. So, I'll attend that one, but right now, I have to tend to my lady. She needs me, and I'm going to be there for her. Good luck with your kid, alright? I'll see you guys around. Alright, baby, let's go. Listen, I'm sorry, okay? I, I just want to protect what's mine. Okay, I just, I get so worked up and possessive and jealous because you're all I have left. You're the only person that I can look at and genuinely say, I love you and mean it. If I lose you, I, I have nothing. That's one of the main reasons why I'm so protective over you. And of course, I don't want you to get hurt by a random person. What do I look like letting you get hurt by somebody else? <laughs> In that way, of course. We don't have to talk about the other way. That's our way. Anyways, that's besides the point. Let's be serious for a second. I will do anything in my power to make sure that you're safe. Okay? I love you so much, baby. Let's go home, okay? I'll... I'll treat you to something special when we get home. <laughs> You're just gonna have to wait and see.